hurts so bad. Oh my god, my eyes are watering. Ah, just get it off. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Mia. Today I'm going to be doing my night skincare routine. So this is what I do every night before I go to bed for my face. Anyways, let's get started. Okay, so at night I'm usually just coming back from dance or some sort of activity and I'm usually really either sweaty, oily, or just gross because I haven't washed my face throughout the day. So usually I have on some makeup, but I don't have any makeup on today, but I'm still going to get all of the oil and gross stuff out with this cellular water. Sometimes I use these face wipes or any other different face wipe brand, but today I wanna to use the cellular water because I don't know, I kind of like it better. Cellular water is really good for your face. It targets 100% of imperfections for soft, healthy looking skin. And it's deep clean, so. That's what we are starting with first to get all the oil and gross stuff off my face. Got a little like cotton ball wipe and we're just gonna put some on it and then wash off my face and get all the oil and gross stuff off. And this stuff does not burn at all. It literally just feels like you're rubbing water all over your face. Cellular water, um, it's really good for your face. It removes your toughest makeup, even waterproof mascara. Exclusively cleans by targeting all skin imperfections like oil, dirt, and pore clogging by makeup. And there is no rinse required. You just have to rub it on your face and it gets it all off. And yeah, you don't have to wash it off. So it's really nice. So. Sometimes if I'm like really tired, I just take my makeup off with this and then go right up right to bed But not usually when I do my entire skincare routine. Okay after the cellular water We are going to put that away and get out our max complexion correction pads This is a really really deep clean to cleanse your skin and to get rid of the blackheads and clear up the pores and it actually kind of stings, especially if you have dry skin. And I don't use this every single day because it will really dry my skin out, but it is really good for your skin. Ugh, it smells really bad, it smells like alcohol. You have dry skin, don't use this because it will burn. Like my skin isn't even that dry, but it's kind of like stinging a little bit. Not a lot, but just a little bit, but yeah, just get that. And this really gets rid of like any extra oil stuff that you have and it's for acne treatment so if you don't have any acne then you wouldn't really have to use this but this really helps to get rid of your acne so yeah next we are going to get out my cleanser and my cleansing brush it's electric it's really nice this stuff is really good i forget what it's called but you can find them like everywhere it's foreo i think i don't know how to pronounce it f-o-r-e-o -E and this refreshing cleanser see it says refreshing cleanser so yeah let's do some of this i've also been using Corology face cleanser they just sent me some face cleansing stuff so i also really like this one but for today i want to use this because i don't know i just love this one so we're gonna use this today i'm just gonna Wet my face, don't mind me. I'm on my knees because the camera won't, won't reach if I'm super high up, so. Usually, ow, oh my god, ow, ow. This stuff, the stuff that burns, it was still on my face and I got it in my eye and it really hurt, but it went away, it doesn't hurt anymore, so I'm good. Anyway, I'm gonna wet my face. I usually do this part in the shower because, I don't know, I just wash my face in the shower, so yeah, but it's the same thing. If I don't get a shower, that night for some reason then I do it out of the shower so yeah get this and just rub it in this cleanser you guys is really good especially for dry skin because I have really dry skin so this is really good for dry skin I don't know <laughs> okay I got it all rubbed in I'm gonna wash off my hands get all the soap off my hands get more water under this brush and then go in with this brush. Ew! It's bleeding. Ugh. 
gonna wash this off right here. Okay, now my face is all dry. Perfect. Guys, please don't mind my hair. I know it's crazy. I didn't feel like doing it before the video because I'm about to go to bed soon, so yeah. Okay guys, my skin already feels super fresh, but next I'm going to put on my face mask. Again, I don't do this every night, but I do it like once a week or so. It is a black mask for all skin types, a bamboo charcoal. It's the peel off kind that gets all your blackheads out, so let's look forward to that. So I have this kind, and this is the Illuminizing Black Mask, and this is also a black mask. These are literally the same thing, but just a different brand. So I think I'm gonna use this one. I think I kinda like this one better, but they're basically the same exact thing, so I don't know. I'm just gonna use this one today because there's more of it in there. So yeah, let's just use this. And again, I don't use this, I don't do this step every day. I do it like once a week. Last night, I put on a sleep fa face mask and it was like coconut milk butter or something and it helped my skin get really soft. So that was nice, but this is a charcoal face mask. So I love my face masks. So all of this stuff in my video, all of the products I'm using, I obviously have a lot more products, but a lot of them I don't use because I go like in and out of what products I use. Sometimes I'll use this cleanser for like a month and then I'll switch cleansers because I have like a hundred different cleansers. This is just my skincare right now. I tend to switch it a lot. So that was basically my point. Two thousand years later. Okay guys, I got on my charcoal face mask and I'm going to wait 15 to 30 minutes and then come and finish my face care routine. So I will be right back. 328 AM. Okay guys, it's been like 25 minutes and now I'm going to take off this mask. Hopefully it doesn't hurt too bad. Now I get all the extra stuff off with some hot water. Ugh, now I'm gonna rinse it off extra with water. Okay guys, now that I have got the face mask off, my skin feels nice and clean. Once I got the face mask all off, I get my toner. It's cucumber and grape seed, and it's very refreshing and hydrating. <coughs> I got it in my nose. <sighs> now I'm just gonna let this dry and soak into my skin. And then we'll move on to the next step. Okay, after my toner has seeped into my skin, I put on my spot treatment. It is tea tree oil and aloe vera gel. Oh, my face is a little bit red from the face mask, but don't worry, that goes away, I hope. 
Last but not least, I get my Corology Moisturizer. But sometimes I use my tea tree oil moisturizer, but I'm using this one because this one's very hydrating and I put a lot of stuff on my face. So let's just moisturize it and not put too many other things on my face. Let's just moisturize. Okay guys, that is it for my face care routine. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment down below what you guys want me to do for my next video because I need some more ideas, so give me some suggestions. Also make sure to follow me on Instagram and subscribe and turn on the notifications because this new thing on YouTube, if you don't turn on notifications, apparently you won't be able to see my video or something. So. Turn on the notifications, comment when done, and I'll pin and like a bunch of your comments. Thanks for watching. Bye!